The product of two negative integers is 391. The smaller of two integers is 11 more than twice the second. What is the smaller of the two integers? So say the bigger value is x, that means the smaller value is going to be 2x plus 11, and they multiply to 391. From there, you can do 2x squared plus 11x equals 391. You can move it over, get 2x squared plus 11x minus 391 equals 0. And from there, 2 times 391 is going to get you 782. So what multiplies to negative 782 and has a difference of 11? It's going to be 23 and 34. So you could do 2x squared plus 34x minus 23x minus 391. This is called the earmuffs method sometimes. So we factor from the first to 2x, x plus 17 minus 23x plus 17 equals 0. And we get x plus 17, 2x minus 23 equals 0. So our answers are x equals negative 17 and 23 over 2. But we're told we're looking for the negatives. So it's really the bigger one is negative 17. You plug that in here to find the smaller value, right? Because that's what we're looking for. And that will be 2 times negative 17 plus 11. That's going to get you negative 34 plus 11. And your answer will be negative 23. Since this is for the SAT and you can use Desmos on the test, the other option, once you have the actual equation, is to just plug it in to Desmos and solve. You just put in x, parentheses, 2x plus 11 equals 391. Zoom out a bit, and you see there's 11.5, and there's the negative 17. And then you just do 2 times negative 17 plus 11, and you get the negative 23 again. Both work great, but this is faster for sure. Make sure to click on the link to see the full video where I predict what's going to be on the March 2025 test. Bye.